It's often called the world's highest garbage dump. Some estimate 50 metric tons of trash remain on Mount Everest due to decades of climbing and lax regulations. But these unmanned aerial vehicles are being utilised to try and clean up one of the world's most remote locations. Ladder. Nepal-based airlift technology is addressing the crisis by deploying drones to deliver both supplies up the mountain and then remove waste on the way down. After successful trials in 2024, the company estimates it removed over one metric tonne of trash between March and May 2025. Here's co-founder Milan Pandey. Yeah. The main intention, of course, was like bringing the garbage because tons of tons of garbage are on in Mount Everest, which means like this is this is the, this are, was our main motive to uh, to have a drone delivery in Mount Everest. The drones made by a Chinese manufacturer are capable of quickly transporting up to 33 pounds of critical supplies, including oxygen bottles, ladders and ropes. Because the interesting thing is, so from base camp to camp one, it takes seven to nine hours for climbers to reach. And our drone can reach over there within three minutes. That helps Sherpas climb difficult sections of the mountain, such as the Kumbu Icefall, a perilous passage riddled with crevasses and icefall without carrying large amounts of equipment. It's a welcome innovation for Nepalese mountaineer Nima Rinji Sherpa. Um, I think this is very uh, interesting and very good in a way because it is humanly impossible to bring all the trash down by carrying through the Kumbu Icefall to the South Pole. So I think yes, right now we're using these drones um, by Alu technology, which is very innovative in a way that it also saves people life, you know, and it makes everyone easier to bring down the trash. While other Everest cleanup operations are ongoing, Airlift Technology hopes drones will provide a new tool and efforts to tackle the mountain's trash scourge.